Sure, guys, yeah, I'm back again. So uh, it's been some time since I actually recorded myself, but I just want to do a quick tip video for you to show you that how to add e, e markers on your playlist. This will help towards the next video that I'll be making on how to arrange our tracks. So let's just get into it. So let's head on over to FL Studio on our playlist. So this is a song which I'm currently done with, so it doesn't actually matter. But what I want us to do is to add markers here. So what you should do, make sure this cursor is right here at the beginning. Once it's here, you go to this drop down, saying time markers. See this is so from then just add one and then it will give you a name. So you can write intro here and then yeah boom and then from here the, the hell is this and you, you can always right click on small especially on this like adjacent line here not on these numbers because it won't do anything when you right click but once you right click just underneath the number you can be able to add a marker and then maybe let's call this synth but not doesn't really matter and you add another marker here we can name this uh, probably say uh, chorus if there was a chorus on this song yeah so that's how you do it so the only thing you should be careful of is that if you don't have this one here at the beginning already you cannot actually mark any of these so for example if i delete this one there this one there this one there can't do anything and then we have the cursor here so when you drop down time markers actually you can have uh, you couldn't but okay it turns out you can doesn't matter but yeah so what we will do on the next video is we're going to uh, arrange a song not really this one but i'm going to show you uh, a simple trick on how to be able to arrange a song just like uh, other top producers show